now Dan Anstey. What's up, mate? Hey, guys. Internationally acclaimed cabaret act Lust or Race playing here at the Forum. You've got until November 29 to check out Hamish Polbo and the can and his mates do their thing. Also, get a load of this for a costume. Imagine if you saw that knocking on your door for Halloween. Good God. Also, remember, Melbourne Cup Carnival kicks off tomorrow. Get along to Derby Day. Details on our website. Love you. Bye. Now, before we get on with the show, I want to stress that we are not and never have been a game show. We couldn't even afford one of the 50 cent hookers from Deal or No Deal. <laughs> hey, a dollar! Two times over. Two times over. You and me both, buddy. <laughs> it's always hot in Brisbane when I'm there. Why doesn't anyone ever swim in the river? Two words, Hughesy. Bull sharks. Yeah, well said, Dan. <laughs> if you took every shark out of the river and lined them up down the Pacific motorway, nose to tail, they would all die. They're water creatures. There's no way they could live. They could swim in the river. It's a perfect solution. Easy. Hey guys, loving it. Easter. Woo! Yeah, here we go. We've discussed this, and you said you wouldn't go on television dressed as Jesus. I'm not Jesus. I'm just one of his mates. I'm just a bloke from Nazareth. Chill. Everybody chill. <laughs> just Terry. Terry the Baptist. I've never heard of him. So he's in there. He's towards the back. You'll find him. Right. Terry. It's fine. Brilliant. They are the fabulous singlets. This is the Melbourne Cabaret Festival. MelbourneCabaret.com for all the info. It's on here and the Q Courthouse. A whole bunch of venues all over Melbourne. Suffice to say, it's going to be absolutely incredible. There are going to be so many feather boas, high heels and pianos. Even Elton John would be like, can we tone this down a little bit? But if that's not quite your speed. That's right. It's also named after the Greek goddess Aphrodite, who was born out of the severed penis of Uranus after it was cut off the bone of the sea. Why would you mention that? I'm so sorry, you were doing facts. I thought I should do a fact. I got caught in the moment. I'm so sorry. You're an idiot. I am. Go check out Kyla tonight, tomorrow night. Tickets still available at the Brisbane Entertainment Centre. That's the other thing. We're not even there. You promised me two things tonight, that we'd see her and that we'd both go dressed as Kylie. I'm sorry, man. I couldn't get people. It's just irritating. All right, boys, the magic number is 92 miles an hour. We've got. I want to crack a ton, though. We've got to get to a ton. We want you to get a ton. Yeah, 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 exactly. I'm a bit worried about this table, though. What's this going to do to us? It might, might send a skyward. Well, that's awesome as well. Yeah, will, we get, yeah. will we get 100 miles an hour into the sky? <laughs> I hope not. I can cook. Hey guys, welcome to Cooking with Dave with our special guest host, Dave Nakotra. Oh yeah. So there you have it, the jet engine powered Daihatsu mirror. Small, frugal, and even more practical now that you can make your dinner with it. Oh.